Hey guys, what's going on? It's Arrow BMP. Uh, today I'm going to be showing you my top 5 SB setting toggles. Um, if you don't know what SB settings is, it is um, an application that you can find in Cydia. It's an application that probably 90% of people at Jailbreak have. It's very useful. Um, you need it for some applications to turn applications on and off. Um, as you can see, I have a PJ net and another application lockdown, um, which helps out when turning those on and off. It's really useful when it comes to doing things quickly. Um, you can do stuff like turning Bluetooth on and off, turning, turning Wi-Fi on and off, all this different stuff, all from this little uh, little menu that, to activate it, all you do is you swipe your finger across the top of your status bar, and it'll come down just like that. So I'm going to go ahead and show you guys the top five tools um, that you can find in SB settings that I think are most useful. So the first one that we're going to get into is autocorrect and what this does is it um, gives you um, the ability to turn on and turn off the autocorrect when typing or doing anything in a text message or something like that. So I'll go ahead and give you guys an example of what I'm talking about while well, I'm actually going to turn it on. We're going to turn autocorrect on so I can show you exactly what I mean. So as you can see right here it says to loop which is apparently a word but if I go like this and then I go like that it said that hello with a bunch of O's is, a, is not a right word, so I'll keep typing. These are all wrong words. They're all mistyped. So if, if you want to turn that off, you're going to come in here, press autocorrect, and now you won't have to worry about having any of that on. All those lines will go away. Now you can type whatever you want without having to worry about autocorrect fixing it and stuff like like if you don't want it you know it's very uh no to see somebody um with a word that ends in ing um leave the g out to save space when text messaging or doing anything like that and uh this will help you because if you're texting something like having it, it, it's going to correct it but if you have the autocorrect on, it's going to always keep adding G, and if you don't have enough characters, maybe it's going to make it to text messages, and that's always a pain in the butt. So, that is very useful. I think that you guys will find it useful as well. Uh, the next one that we're going to get into is auto lock, and what this one will do is this will keep your phone from falling asleep. Um, I want to keep the video short, so I'm not going to test that, but, it, you know, it, it works. I've tested it out multiple times. It will keep your phone awake as long as you want it to, and all you gotta do is turn it on and turn it off. And, and the next one is right next to it, keep awake. That kind of goes hand in hand. If you don't wanna uh, keep your phone awake all the time, then you could get keep awake because it keeps your Wi-Fi um, connection awake while your phone is asleep, which um, normally isn't possible. So that's another good application that might kind of go hand in hand with auto lock if you don't wanna, um, you know, waste your battery with keeping your screen on. So, uh, the next one that we're going to get into, that was one, two, three, that was three. So the next one is Softresh, and what that is, is um, this gives you the, the ability to decide when um, Cydia loads new packages. And I'm sure you guys know that when you start up Cydia, every time you start up Cydia, um, you know, right from the beginning, it loads all these new packages right up at the top and it, you know, all these things start going and happening. Right now, um, no Cyfresh is on, so it will not do that. It will just load up Cydia and that's it. And this will definitely help saving time, especially when you're looking for a specific package and you already know what you want. And you're not just coming to browse new packages. So normally, if you go into changes, obviously it always loads the changes. That takes about 5-10 seconds to load up. And then after it's loading up, normally on the top, right where it says Home in Cydia, you'll get a annoying bar that takes about a minute to load, and then after that, you have to press OK, and it takes another, you know, 30 seconds, and it's a long time just when you want to go and download something, and you could have been done by that time. So this will just stop that from happening altogether. And it's taking a long time. Feel free to fast forward through this. Alright, so this is a 
what I was talking about. <clears throat> that little bar up there says updating database. I made that happen by pressing on the refresh. So you can be the person that controls for that from happening. And uh, that's when no side fresh is. Uh, so the last one that we're going to be going into is uh, remove background. And what that is, is it's an application that allows you to remove all your background apps all at once. I did make a video about this uh, a little while back, um, but I figured I'd just, you know, throw it in here just in case some of you guys didn't see that video. Now I can't um, show you guys what this does right now because it will um, end screen splitter, which is um, how I'm making this video. It's allowing me to connect my phone to the computer. So... I can't show you that it works, but it does work, and it works perfectly. Um, there's another version of this, kind of, in the City of App Store called Remove Background, and this, uh, what this allows you to do is um, set activator to whatever you want uh, to, to end all that application. So you could just, you know, make it a, a swipe of the status bar or pinching the, pinching the screen or something like that, that, that will... Um, and all the processes, whatever you want to make it. But that is all, though, that is my top five SB settings. Um, if you have any problems with any of the applications or you have any questions, feel free to leave me a comment or to send me a message and I will absolutely get back to you guys. But that is it. I will talk to you guys later.